Good kitten internet. The kitten's right there. Boop, boop, boop. Anyway, um, thought I'd briefly talk today about food. So, um, it's... You want to be on my shoulders again, don't you? Meow. He was on my shoulders right before I started recording, but I had to stand up in order to record so he couldn't be on my shoulders anymore because I was sitting down. Did you want to join me in sitting down? I think the internet would love it if you were walk riding on my shoulders, kitty cat. Let's try this. I'll sit down, see if he will come closer. This was actually the stupid pet trick that I tried to do for one year at Epic. Um, I don't know if he will. I will try. <laughs> Microphone's in the way. Not even using that microphone at the moment. I can put that down. I'm actually sitting at my computer desk, thus mess behind me. It's a dining room table, but I don't eat at it. I only use it for projects, and I haven't cleaned it off in months. You're not going to sit on my shoulders, are you? <laughs> anyway, so I am talking about food today. Um, so... There's a few things I'm going to miss about Madison when I move. And beyond just my friends, people, people that I consider my family and so on, or the general political climate of Madison, one of the things that I'm going to miss the most and I'm going to need a lot of getting used to is my reduction in food options, shall we say. Because so Madison, well, if I'm hungry, I can just order delivery. Um, I do make enough where it's not that big of a deal if I order delivery, and I average about once a week for reference. So it's not like I'm indulging that often. He's just doing this the entire time. Anyway, um, so it's not like I do that that often, but it's more the fact that I have a very large variety of choices. So, like earlier today, for instance, I ordered from a pizza place, it's a local chain called Glass Nickel Pizza, and I decided I wanted one of their lunch specials, so I ordered a small pizza pie and a sandwich. And, okay, that's fine. I have a lot more than just one option, though. And that's where things turn to the absurd, and I know I've mentioned this before in a vlog, but I just want to detail just how absurd things get. Now, keep in mind, um, some of these are going to be grayed out because I'm recording this at, uh, 2130 at night, roughly. So not everything's open at the moment, but you kind of get the idea. I, I have a lot of options. Um, just look at some of these choices, like 206 sub and sandwich restaurants, um, 58 seafood restaurants, uh, what's some of the weirder ones? Um, three Jamaican food restaurants, that's up from two from earlier this year um four hawaiian food restaurants yeah um these are all places that deliver to my house or have the ability to take out and they're not that far away from me i think they're within they're definitely within city limits area but are not necessarily city limits so much as the metro area so to speak but you get the idea. This is all really close to me. In fact, I actually... Apologies for constantly shaking because I'm not using a tripod because kitty. Um, I actually did a quick map search and there are the number of restaurants that are within a walk or a short bus ride from my house is 220. Medicine has some of the most plentiful food in the United States when it comes to restaurants, especially given its size. About the only place that I know of that matches are really large cities like New York City and Chicago. 
I am not going to have that when I move to Bergen. In fact, all right, just checked, uh, at least looking via Google Maps, which isn't the most reliable way of doing it, but it's the apples to apples comparison that I have. Um, 75 restaurants for Bergen. And Bergen's a slightly larger city than Madison. Not to mention it's the second largest city in Norway. So yeah, not not great by comparison. And also, eating out in a restaurant is far more expensive in Norway than it is in the U.S. Uh, but never mind in Madison, which is fairly cheap for food in general. Yeah, so just wanted to do a quick log today. I'm kind of busy today. Yeah, that's about it. So I'll talk to you tomorrow, Internet. Bye.